If an app like Instagram starts to keep crashing on a phone like the Google Pixel 7, the problem is often pretty minor and you might only need to do a few procedures to fix it. Generally, app crashes aren't really serious. There are times when they're just due to a glitch in the system or a temporary server issue. In this video, we will show you how to fix Instagram that keeps crashing on Google Pixel 7. But before anything else, make sure to like and share our videos so we can help other users who might have issues with their devices. Going back to our tutorial, here's what you should do. First solution, force stop Instagram and reopen it. In most cases, restarting an app will fix random crashes, especially if the problem is caused by a glitch in the system. Thus, the first thing you have to do is to restart the app itself. To do that, swipe up from the bottom of the screen and stop in the middle. This will show you the apps that you recently used including Instagram that stopped responding. Swipe up on each app preview to close them or you can simply close Instagram and leave other apps running. After doing that, reopen Instagram to see if it works properly this time. In most cases, this is the only thing you need to do. However, if the problem continues, then move on to the next solution. Second solution, force restart your Pixel 7. If restarting the app won't fix the problem, then it's possible that the issue is with the firmware itself. Even a minor glitch in the system can lead to app crashes so you need to rule out that possibility. And to do that, you have to force restart your phone. Here's how it's done. Press and hold the power key for 30 seconds. You might see some services open while you're doing it but continue holding the power key as your phone will soon shut down. You only have to release the power key after the phone powers down and the Google logo shows on the screen. Once you've done that, relaunch Instagram to see if it still crashes at some point. If it still does, then move on to the next solution. Third solution, check Instagram server. Server maintenance is necessary, and sometimes it occurs a few times in a month. It is possible that the problem is caused by a server issue, and if that's the case, you really don't need to do anything as the problem can be fixed by itself. However, you need to check if it's really a server issue or not so that you won't have to waste your time troubleshooting your phone if it really is a server issue. To do that, launch a web browser. Log on to downdetector.com. Search for Instagram and click on it once it shows. Scroll down to the bottom to see if other users have the same problem as you because if so, then it's a widespread issue and can be due to a server problem. However, if the most reported problem is not, in any way, relevant to the issue you're experiencing, then you have to move on to the next solution. Fourth solution, clear the app's cache and data. You can also fix app-related issues by simply resetting the app in question. An app reset means to delete its cache and data. You don't have to worry though because any data in your Instagram account won't be deleted. Such a procedure is easy to do but very effective. Here's how it's done. Pull up the app drawer and find Instagram. Once found, tap and hold its icon until the menu shows. Tap the app info icon. Tap storage and cache. Tap clear cache. Tap clear storage and tap delete to confirm. And just like that, you've already reset Instagram. Fifth solution, reinstall Instagram. After doing the previous solutions and Instagram continues to crash, then your last resort will be to uninstall the app and then reinstall it. Doing so will delete all its installation files, which might have been corrupted, and will make sure you're running the latest version of the app. To do that, pull up the app drawer and find Instagram. Once found, tap and hold its icon until the menu shows. Tap the app info icon. Tap uninstall and select OK. Once the app is uninstalled, launch the Play Store. Search for Instagram and reinstall it. After doing that, the app should already work properly. We hope this guide can be helpful. You may subscribe to our channel to support us or click one of our videos to continue watching. Have a great day.